on that. But, uh, but the great story is the one of the kid who really got the confidence. Yeah. So say your name and where are you from? I'm Terry Osborne from uh, Bellevue Public Schools. Um, the story I have is, is about um, how storytelling can make a difference. And in the kindergarten classrooms, we maybe spend 50% of our time telling stories. We don't always get to tell stories, but reading stories and telling stories is a great um, fun thing to do. So uh, one time I was reading a story, which I, I like to read every year, and it's called Who Way for Wadney Wat, and it's by Helen Lester. And if a person hasn't read the story, they have to know that Wadney is a rodent who can't say his R's, and that's why his name is Wadney. And Wadney gets teased a lot, but by the end of the story, he becomes a hero. And so at this one kindergarten class, I was reading the story, just like I always do, and the kids were being entertained and liking it and so forth, and I, at the end of the story, that was that. We just you know went on with whatever. And maybe three weeks later, um, we had a PTA activity, and a mom came up to me and she said, you know, after you read that Rodney Rat story, uh, or Wadney Watt, uh, my daughter came home and she told us the whole story. She just loved it. But what we noticed was before she couldn't say her R's. And after you read the story, she could say her R's. So how would I expect to have an impact on something as simple as that by reading a story? I, I didn't think that would ever happen. but. The mom made a point to come and tell me that, yeah, what you did made a difference because our kid can say her R's. And so. that gave her the child the confidence mm -hmm. to work with the language skills yeah, that, that she did. It was that you've been helping to instill. Yeah, and I'm sure the the parents were going, well, how come you how come you learned to say your R's? Uh, you know, where did that come from? And she said it was from the book. Oh, that's so cool. And so yeah, so I thought it was pretty neat too, and I remembered that because it's just one of those things. Yep, libraries, you can do it. <laughs> Thanks so much, Terry. You're welcome.